Okay, I think that's as good as we're gonna get. I don't fucking understand. This is really annoying. I think I'm gonna need to call my ISP because this is totally hosed. I, it seems like I'm getting throttled. Uh, okay. Let's get started. Hmm. Put on my wrist strap. Hell no. All the illicit videos I stream, yeah. That's it. Strap off, you can't stop me now. What's awkward, blue bar? Chapter 1 Reptid's Cave. Got any ideas to cheer you up? Wait, oh, you scaly bastards! It's always streams. We're just getting, getting started Darren, now. Move it! Over it! Alright. Oh man. Graphics do not look as good on this as I remember them looking. Alright. Uh, Alright. I skipped that tutorial. Maybe that's not the greatest idea, but... Whatever. Uh, let's see here. You never said we'd be playing tag. Just do your job. Oh, shit. How the hell does this game work? I don't Thank remember. Let's look at these... Movement and camera. That's probably a good thing to look at first. Uh, use L to move. Press ZL to reset the camera to a position behind the player character. Use the control stick to move. Yeah, okay, I figured that out. Press Z to reset the camera. Yeah. Okay, I know that. Oh, what? Well, that was it? Okay, fine. I'd fine. I'd rather think of the bee you're gonna buy me with it. Only if you get more of these things than me. Alright, it's on. Try not to fall too far behind, eh? You have a monstrous ego there. Then you can look forward to my... A trap. A trap! It's a trap! New tutorial. Yeah, of course they're British people. When near an obstacle, press A to hide. Press A again to emerge from cover. Hiding allows you to evade enemy attention. Yeah, oh yeah, it's definitely still dropping frames, Luxury Wagon. Um, yeah, I don't know what the fuck it's doing, though. So. Hold down. Wait, what the fuck? What did it say? Uh, A to hide, press again to climb over. And. Oh, okay, hold R2. Just run straight over the ship. There we go. Oh yeah, this dude's got chaps, she's got chaps. It's all chaps, all the time. In fact, they have the same armor on. New tutorial. Uh, 
Press oh right, okay, yeah, I remember this. Uh, you press X to open the. Right, because by default you basically just run up to a guy and it auto fights, um, which sucks. I'm holding our guards. Alright, so we're gonna go to the menu, we're gonna go to options. Uh, move slash attack. No, we wanna do this one. Attack type. Oh, right, I see. Attack type manual. Uh, yeah. Boat rocking? Oh, okay, right. Toggle camera rocking when aboard boats. Uh, okay. And we will call that good for now. Let's move. Here, you think that grenade surrender ahead? Yeah, let's go and find them. All right, so Zale is actually the one that you play throughout the entire game. He also has a crossbow, which is somewhat arbitrary. This place is crawling with these things. What do we do? I don't think they've noticed us yet. Oh, these are, I mean, just like every, uh, every Final Fantasy style game, what you start with is not even, that not even close to, uh, you want to destroy that. Yurik, hit that pillar with your magic. The pillar? Oops. Not the reptiles. I see. I'll give it a shot. I probably should have waited and not been a fucking idiot. Oh well. Uh... Ooh! Got a nice head fetish. Dagon and Serena messed up. Yurik, let's go. No one's dying while I'm here. Wait! Today I'll rescue you, Dagrin. I'm pretty sure those two can look after themselves. You They're my I friends. Mean. I can't just sit here. I'm not really into that kind of thing. <laughs> okay. If you know what I mean. They're close. I can hear them. Zale, stop. Don't get carried away. It's not a gunblade, but That's a lot. it could very easily be. So, in case it was not obvious, Yurik is a, uh, Yurik, he's a caster. destroy that bridge. I don't know. It looks pretty tough. Fucking get over Yurik. it, buddy. Fine. Don't blame me if it goes wrong. Uh, so, Yurik is a caster. Saren is a... Uh, Dual wielding uh, fighter. Dagran is a single wielded fighter, whatever, just like a normal idiot. Um, Very nice, boys. Zale, Yurik, good job. We like to use our brains sometimes, not like Seren here. I touch where we creep. Save it for later. Let's clean up. <laughs> the hand cross over. Hey, 10 Forward Podcast. Oh, wait, isn't that. Isn't that Kelsey Grammer? Uh, all right. What? Really? Really? Zayl, Big boy. Protect Yurik as he's casting. Okay, understood. Can't go on both of you. Or we could just let the vectors take them off our hands. <laughs> Figured that's what happened. 
Oh, shit. Uh, right, okay, so... We're learning as we go here. Um... Yeah, so you have a, you well, have five lives. Looks like the coast is clear. Right. Is you know, everyone given okay? combat. Yeah. So you can kind of die easy. five times. Let's move on. Uh, this is on Wii. This game. Uh, Looks like we have a new client. There you go. Woo! All right. Just as we're about to run out of money, too. Thanks to someone getting hammered on the tape. Shut it. I risked my life out there. Let me drink in peace. So, may I ask who our next client is? It's Count Argonen. Wow. The ruler of Lazarus Island. That's quite a result. There's a huge cannon on that island. But all that magic is dangerous. It draws all kinds of monsters to the Yeah, island. you have five life bars, basically. There's certain reason I, I don't remember. I think buffs disappear you when you with when you lose a life bar, so there is a reason paid, to not just count it as one big life bar. Yeah, right. I don't remember anyway, exactly, but... I reckon it's there's a reason to not die so much. Barman, here's with the best you've got! <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, they have goblin teeth. I can't say I paid attention enough. I will keep an eye out in the next next cutscenes. All right, save game. I've played this game a couple times before, but I'm playing it on the Wii U, so I don't have any saves on here. Take a good look. Some of them can use magic. Hmm. Zale, go and flank them from the right. At your signal, we'll charge from the front. Got it. Hmm. We'll finish this before they know what's hit them. <laughs> yeah, I would think you'd have some interesting, interesting marking on the your chest. In the center will cause us some grief. All right, so I this want is this Kennedy. fast and clean. Yeah, a kind of overview of of the battle arenas before you start the fight. So we start over here. Um, there's some spots to go over here, although that's not... Oh, I guess that allows you to kind of sneak in the back. So you got Sorcerer, Healer, Swordsman, 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 Swordsman. Try Wicking Fabric, yeah. I'm sure they've developed that. So ultimately we want to take out that Healer. This guy's a fire dude. Yurk is a fire dude. All right, in case that wasn't obvious before. I'll flank them from the right. They got lookouts in position already. Okay, so now they're teaching me how to use the crossbow. Right. Is there something that was pointed out before at another point? Was that you have these wizard slayer arrows, which basically do bonus damage to uh, to casters. Go on, sneak up those stairs, buddy. Sneaky. So I want to take out the healer. Now! Get rocks. Yeah. All right, so we got some level ups. Oh, you know what? You know why this looks so much worse than the last time I played it? Because the last time I played it, I actually played so, it on an emulator. How are we supposed to had, over like, anti-aliasing and everything I'm cranked pretty sure up. this has something to do with it. This game looks really good in an emulator, I'll tell you that. What does this do?
It's a crossbow blade. Who makes something so dangerous? It's totally irresponsible. I'd say it definitely looks man-made. Dagrun, I'm hungry. Let's try to be professionals, okay? What? If I'm hungry, then I'm hungry. If I get killed because I'm too hungry and weak to fight, then don't blame me. If you've got the energy to whine like that, I'm sure you'll be fine. I like all the banter in this game. There's a lot of banter between characters, which helps make them, you know, more realistic and all. Any luck? I can see light. Hey, try giving it a little tap. You don't mess around. Boop the wall. This just never ends. <laughs> Where are we? Some kind of ruins. It's cold, it's weird, and it stinks. I don't like it. Well, these aren't suspicious at all, are they? Yeah, I don't think Saran did stop at the Wendy's. A dead end. Yurik, let's look for an alternate route. Hey, shouldn't we stick together? No, it's easier to scout with fewer people. <laughs> Always. Saran. Get Let's split up while you can. I'm sure there's more trouble waiting for us. Through the hole and on the glory. Sail, keep your pants on. You better get some rest while you can. I can't help it if I'm worried. What was that? It's just the wind. <laughs> Don't be such a <sighs> chicken. Oh god. Hmm? <laughs> uh oh. Today is not my day. Look, you're this big, manly man. Dagger never told us about these things. I can hold them! Wait, is this a secret part? It's not particularly a secret if you just walk up to it and it opens. What the hell are you doing? Move it! This way! I said move! They're catching up! Not much further! Keep it up! I'll hold them up here. You search for another way out. Uh, okay, so we're searching for another way out. Another way out. I'll hold them up here. You search for another way out. Not there. No good. Damn. A dead end. Looks like this is it. These skeletons just keep coming back. Boom! Heart shot. Yeah, you basically start the game in a dungeon. Correct. Mommy. Yeah, it gets you right into it and it kind of walks you through a dungeon as a tutorial, so that's kind of neat. Zale! No. Mom. 
Oh, I can see the lag is shit Sorry. as all hell, though. I don't want to be alone anymore. I'm sick of it. Sick of all the pain. Choose your favorite. What is this? God, is this stuttering really, really bad? Who is it? Who's there? Your heart is like mine. Filled with loneliness and sorrow. Who? Who are you? <laughs> Yeah, no, I, I'm fairly certain it's the actual my video feed. Alright, so we've got this thing called Gathering now. What's going on? It basically. Well, it'll probably explain it here. Protect those who are precious to me. What does it mean? Alright, so let's look at the tutorial here. So, gathering. The focus of an enemy is indicated by a beam of light called a target line. The type of enemy can be determined by the color of its target line. Uh, so the gathering forcibly draws enemy attention. Press L to activate it and press L to release it. Uh, speed reduction of an enemy targeting Zale is shown by the number of down arrow icons above its head. Uh, while gathering is activated, Zale can revive incapacitated allies by touching them. Allies revived by cure receive a temporary boost in abilities. Oh, so that's another thing. So when when your allies get a life bar knocked down, they are stuck down until you revive them. Um, allies revived by cure receive a temporary boost in abilities. Zale. So there we go. Is everyone okay? Zale, this is weird. Really weird. I'm just as confused as you are. I heard this voice in my head and... What the hell is going on? Okay, Zale, draw the enemy into... These things don't stay down. Some people say the undead are given new life in the underworld. I've heard that somewhere before. They do say fairy tales and legends have a grain of truth in them. All I know is I'll smash them. What just happened? Oh. Oh. There was a way out. Sale. You useless idiot. Sure I am. While using gathering your allies casting speed will double, okay. Yeah, go make a deal with horrendous dark powers. Well it doesn't it's not that evil that we're aware of. Um I'm just going to Oops. I'm gonna Take one more shot at fiddling with the the stream to try and kill that stuttering. <laughs> 